Bye bye. This guy's pink, All right, what do you think? Headed to the hospital. We might have to record it a little bit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was just gonna say, uh, it's definitely weird when you're when you have to leave your first child to go have your second one because there's a lot of you that just like misses that first child and like I don't know, it's just like really sad. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, it's six fifty-seven on Which April fifth. No. Sixth. <laughs> April sixth. 2023, we're headed in. It's a great angle. They just started Pitocin, and I'm seven centimeters dilated without being Already. in labor. Yep. So they think a baby soon. We'll see. I'm getting a contraction. So they just broke Megan's water and... I'm still set though. So yeah, the water breaking is gonna progress things, but uh, in the meantime, it's almost it's almost noon. So we might... What time? hungry. Yeah, what time do they bring lunch? I don't know. Probably. They brought breakfast at like 10. <laughs> I might go try to get uh, some lunch and it's also really cold in here. So get my crew neck out of the car, which is funny enough right down there anyway that's the update how are you feeling Update. Everyone's doing good. We made it. How are you feeling? Have you recorded since he's been born? Yeah. Oh. Uh, I ate and drank, and I feel a lot better. I was feeling really, really bad. Um, but yeah, I hadn't eaten since breakfast and hadn't really drank much. So I ate lunch at 
3.30. And I feel good. Um, he nursed well. And now I just want to take a nap. <laughs> so, yeah, she did great. Um, I guess for the video's sake, we didn't really say any of this, but oh. he's 7 pounds, 15 ounces, 19 inches long. And he was born at 105. 105. So he weighs more than Ellie, but I think she was 19 and a half inches long, so. Yeah. And, and he um, looks like Andrew. Yeah. <laughs> He's a cutie. Um, and of course, everybody wants to come in and see him, so we'll see if we got, get some of that later. But mm. yeah, we're all doing good now. Megan did it without the epidural, and well, she. May have been screaming for she it. She was know. a champion for that. <laughs> she got it done. So. Ellie, do you want to see Harrison? Yeah. You want to see Harrison? Come on, he's in here. You want to see baby? Look. This is Harrison. Look. Look. That's Harrison. Do you hear him crying? He's crying. Do you see Harrison? Yeah. Mommy. Hi, baby. Do you want to come up here and see Harrison? Did you miss mommy? Do you like your brother? What's his name? What? <laughs> no. What's your brother's name? Baby. What's his name? Did you remember? What's his name? Harrison? Harrison. For Milky? Okay, so it's almost noon. Megan just took a shower and she's feeling a lot better. Um, I was not doing so well. You would say that you were feeling kind of lightheaded. Um, so I think maybe after some lunch she'll feel even better. But um, yeah, Harrison got checked out. He, they said he's doing great. And um, yeah, Megan's starting to feel better. And they said they put in her discharge. So uh, we should be out of here this afternoon. And, uh, he has to be here until at least 1.05. Yeah. So sometime after that. But I've already gotten checked out by the midwife, so I am good to go. So we'll be out of here soon. All right, Harrison, do you want to go home? Time to go home, buddy. So I made it to the car at 3.43. All right, let's go.